Hello students, how are you? I am Pushkar, Master Teacher in Chemistry at Vedantu and we are discussing ITJ Advanced 2020 Chemistry Paper. Let's solve the question number 3 in paper 2. The question is, in a chemical reaction between stoichiometric quantities of KMnO4 and Ki in weekly basic solution, what is the number of moles of I2 released? for 4 moles of KMnO4 consumed. So basically it is the reaction between KMnO4 and Ki. Pretty straightforward question. As we know, the MnO4 negative is going to react with I negative and it's going to change into, in basic medium it's going to change into MnO2 and I2 is liberated. So in the process, you need to know the mole factor, n factor of these respective species. For that, you need to know the change in oxidation numbers. As you know, in MnO4 negative, magnesium is in plus 1 oxidation state. In MnO2, it is in plus 4 oxidation state. So the change in oxidation number is equals to 3. So the n factor of this is equals to 3. Now, 4 moles of KmO4 is consumed. 4 mole is equal to 4 into 3 is equal to 12 equivalents. So in this reaction, the number of equivalents of MnO4 negative used is equals to 12. So what is the number of moles of I2 released? So definitely this also will be 12 equivalents of I2 will be released. And the n factor of I2 in this reaction will be 2. Because if you see the change in oxidation number of iodine here, so iodine I2 is coming from oxidation number of minus 1. So there are two iodine atoms in I2 and there is a change of 1 in each. So the net change is equals to 2. So the n factor of I2 is 2 and you can convert this into moles by using the formula number of mole is equals to number of equivalents divided by n factor. So that will give you the answer 12 12 equivalents, 12 equivalents divided by the n factor of this was 2 is equals to 6 mole. So no need to balance this equation, it's pretty straightforward question. Stay tuned for other questions, solutions to the other questions. Thank you.